Welcome everyone to the Mile High City, Denver, Colorado, site of the 2005 EA Sports Slam Dunk Contest. I'm Ernie Johnson, and joining me is Kenny the Jet Smith, and we're about to get things started. Let's go courtside for player introductions. Denver, Colorado, get on your feet and welcome the 2005 Slam Dunk Contestants. From the 80s All-Stars, at six foot seven, Julius Irving. From the 80s All-Stars at 6 foot 8, Dominique Wilkins. From the 80s All-Stars at 6 foot 7, Clyde Drexler. From the 90s All-Stars at 6 foot 7, Scotty Pippen. Your judges for tonight's competition, former slam dunk champion, Anthony Spudwell. He won the first ever NBA All-Star slam dunk competition, Larry Nance. Nine-time All-Star, the Iceman, George Gervin. Former NBA champion and 12-time All-Star, Moses Malone. 10-time All-Star, Kareem Abdul-Jabbar. Irving is the first one up tonight. He's going to want to set the bar high to put some pressure on the rest of the guys. Now let's see if he'll come up with something original here. Oh, look at this. Turn, baby, turn. That's the way you get everything moving and everything going in one direction. I give it two tens, 20. <laughs> you were right, Kenny. They're unanimous with the tens. That man has just taken a step into legendary status. You the man, son. That's a great start there, Kenny. Wilkins is up next and looks ready to go. Let's see if he has any early nerves here, Kenny. See what he can do here. Oh, off the lob. Oh, and that, that dunk just got better and better. That dunk is so difficult because not only going through with the legs, but you're spinning and doing a 180 at the same time. What a finish. That was sick. I'm going to give it like a nine and a half, 9.5. Hard to be disappointed with that, Kenny. Those are some pretty nice scores. That's perfect, man. I see he didn't deserve a 50, and he didn't get one. But that's a good score for him. That was good enough to put him in second. Drexler is up next with his first try of the night. Let's see the degree of difficulty here. The toss. You a big fan of tossing the ball to yourself? Yeah, because I think that's difficult. But when you're doing it in front, it's not as difficult. But what it does, he had great elevation and a great finish. That's that's pretty normal. That was in pretty a dunk stylish. I in think. a dunk contest, it's normal. That was nice. That was nice. I'll give that a nine. Well, not bad, Jed. He gets eights from everyone. That'll give him a score of 40 there. That's about right. That was good, but he can do better, and he knows it. Only good enough for third after that dunk. Pippen is last up to dunk here in the first round. Some of the guys think by going last, you really have the advantage in this competition. We'll see how that theory pans out here as he's ready. 360! A 360 between the legs. This is elevation at its finest. That's like a 10 plus. 10 and then some. 11, 12, 13, whatever. 10s across the board, Jet. A perfect score. I'm still shaking my head over here. That was just crazy. Irving is ready to lead us off with the final attempts of the first round. Well, let's see what he has cooked up here. 
Whoa! I thought it was too high, Ernie. I thought that was too high. Nothing is beyond his reach. Eleven. I've never seen anything like that. Never. You called it, Kenny. He gets a perfect score for that. Yeah, that's right. He deserves it, too. I still can't believe what I saw. Julius Irving with a score of 50. Wilkins is up again for his final dunk attempt of the round. He may throw in a little something extra to cap off his first set of dunks. Any combination adding up to 42 will do it for him here. Out there on the right one. Oh, that's special. That right there is special, ladies and gentlemen. Didn't even let it bounce. When you go get it and you throw it in the air, that's impressive. That's a tough call. I give that like a, a ten, no nine and a half. I think he's going to be pretty happy with those scores, Chet. Yeah, he did all right there. He'll be happy with that. Not quite enough to take the lead with that dunk. Drexler is now up for his final attempt of the round. Let's see if he can finish off strong. Need to see something special here. Uh, oh, and he puts his elbow in the rim just to let you know how high he was up. Love the hang time. That's got to hurt, though. It's got to hurt. It doesn't. Yeah, right. Now they better give him a 50 on that. I give it to him like a 55. There it is, a perfect score, Kenny. Look at him over there like that wasn't no big deal. Just give him the crown now, man. Pippen is up next with the last dunk of the first round of competition. A good, solid dunk should be enough for him here. Starting from out of bounds, that power was good. And the elevation, and he cocked it back. Not bad. Just to get yourself into a rhythm. He's got to show us a little bit more if he wants some tens. That's like a 40 or 45. Well, that's about in the same ballpark. He'll finish up with 40 there. That's all right. He just doesn't look too happy. But he's got to understand, not every dunk can be perfect. That'll put him second, Kenny. Drexler has to make this one count. He's got one attempt to try and advance out of this tiebreaker round. He can't afford to miss, and he can't afford to hold anything back. Uh-huh. Not bad. That's impressive because what happens, people don't understand how difficult that is to throw that alley oop to yourself and the timing to go catch it and go get it from as far out as he is. I say he gets about a 46 or a 47 for that. Just a little cleaner would have got him a 50. He's not clean enough. Go to the bathroom. A total of 49 there, Jet. You were right, though it wasn't quite good enough for a perfect score. This guy is one of the best dunkers in the league. And I think he's got one more level, though. Come on, young man. Show me something. Pippen, the final dunker in this tiebreaker. He knows the magic number that'll get him to the next round. Just a matter of him showing the judges enough to get him there. A little toss to himself here. Now, see, the toss was average, but the dunk was great. See, you can't have an average toss and a great dunk because it's all together. You have to put the package together. That's not a 10, but it was pretty nice, so I'll give him a 9. A bit of a mixed bag there, Jet, but no real surprise. I think he wanted a little more, but that wasn't a 10. He got what he deserved there. You'll be all right, young fella. You'll be all right. That round is complete as we take a look at who's moving on. 
Drexler looks ready to go with the first dunk of the second round. Oh, you can hear the wheels spinning. What's he coming up with here? Oh, this could be huge. What a perfect feed. If you're a judge, you gotta love this. You have to love his timing and his creativity. The pass was perfect, and the finish was exquisite. Exquisite? I like that. That's what I'm talking about. I'm going to say that that was at least a 9. Maybe a 10. Okay, a 10. You were about right, Jet. Almost a perfect score there, but that one nine will leave the door open just a crack. Yeah, he showed me something there. That was nice. Clyde Drexler with a score of 49. Wilkins will now attempt his first dunk of the second round. He's always a crowd pleaser. Well, he just wanted to show us that he could float. But everyone you in his like contract. That's easy. But everyone could float in his contract. And see, normally you would dunk from the free throw line to do that to show your elevation. He jumps from the side. We have no idea how far he went and how far he jumped out. It was way out there. It wasn't that far. Yes, it was. You can't tell from that angle. I could. That's nice. But I'm telling you, this guy can do better. He can do better. He's not getting any tens for that. Maybe an eight. Well, judges are on the fence between 8 and 9. Total of 42 there. Yeah, he'll be all right with that. That's pretty good. That score puts him in second place. Irving will close things out here as we finish up the first attempts of the second round. Good cost. He went and got it. He went and got that. Now that is impressive. That's Jay. impressive because it's so difficult to throw an alley-oop to yourself. Then they go get it. Then they come back. Oh, that is impressive. Forget 10. I'm giving that like a 12. That was the best dunk I've ever seen. It's unanimous, Kenny. Tens across the board for a huge 50. I keep telling you guys, there are dunks we haven't seen before. Well, there's one of them. He's in the top spot with that dunk. Drexler will go again as he starts these last set of dunks in this second round with one final attempt. Uh-oh, look at this, Kenny. I mean, this one was well thought out. The creativity, the thought process, the precision, the timing. Look at him catch it. Look at him catch it. And good hang time. 50, 50, 50, no question about it. That's like the dunk of the year. Only 110 on the board as we take a look at the scores. That's like the sickest dunk I've ever seen. You got to give him a 50. That's tough, man. That's tough. Wilkins is up again with his final dunk of this middle round. One last chance to show the judges why he should advance. What's he going to do here? We got to see what... what, what? Well, that's a tough toss. Oh, that's, that's a tough toss and a tough catch! I was trying to figure out how he made the toss to begin with, much less where it was headed. But to catch it, to toss it, a perfect pass. He should lead the league in assists making passes like that. I think he could do better, but I'm going to say 8 or 9 anyhow. That was pretty sick. Looks like you were about right, Kenny. The judges are back and forth there with, let's see, three eights and a couple of nines. Yeah, you got to show the judges a little more than that if you want to get up in the 10 range. That was good enough to put him in second. Irving again looks poised and ready to go. This dunk will be the last of the round, and it'll be his last chance to impress the judges before the final cuts. Whoa, look at this. Oh, if he could pass to anyone else like that, he's passing to himself. That's to himself, Ernie.
Ernie, that's gonna go down as one of the greatest dunks in history. Give that man the crown and let's go home, because it's over. Pretty enthusiastic with the tens there, Jet. He easily gets 50 for that. Yeah, and he deserves it too. He's gotta be one of the sickest dunkers ever. And he'll take the lead with that score. It's decided this round's done and we know who's in and who's out. Drexler will now start things off in the final round. Oh, I'm expecting big things right here. Well, that's a little different, little kick. Oh, he's going up for the windmill! Oh, a la Dominique Wilkins! A la Jason Richardson. But you know what? Don't forget about a guy, Jerome Kersey. He had the same dunks with power. That was sick! Are you kidding me? That was a 50, no doubt about it. And there we see it, all 10s for a perfect score. Yeah, that's right, he deserves it too. I still can't believe what I saw. Clyde Drexler with a score of 50. Never Irving is up now for his first dunk of the final round. He's seen what the other guy had to offer. We'll see what he brings to the table. How's he getting that thing? This guy has taken this contest by storm. He gets some ooing and eyeing with the pass, and then the thunderous finish. That's a 50! A 50! Are you kidding me? No surprise here, Kenny. A perfect 50. Look at him over there like that wasn't no big deal. Just give him the crown now, man. Julius Irving with a score of 50. Drexler will try and clinch the crown with his last dunk of the competition. See if he's got a little something different planned here. Looks like he'll toss it to himself. Okay, that's not an attempt. As far as I know, if he doesn't actually attempt the dunk, he can retry it, and it doesn't count as a replacement dunk. That's a good hit, because it gives you a little bit, a little showmanship, a little difference. You're not just throwing it up and lobbing it. I'm a showman. That's maybe like an 8 or a 9. It's nice, but I, I think he held back a little bit. You pretty much called it, Kenny, a mix of 8s and 9s from the judges. That's all right. He just doesn't look too happy, but he's got to understand, not every dunk can be perfect. Clyde Drexler with a score of 42. Next Irving will be our last Lewis. dunker of the night. I'm looking for the big throwdown from him. Tens would be great, but eights and nines should be enough for him here. See how he starts this thing. What he did was he forgot that he needed something spectacular. He just came with something average. This is the ending, the end all. You have to bring it. All right, all right. I'm going to say that was like an 8.5. I need some more numbers or something. So that won't cut it. And that means we have ourselves a winner, folks. This year's slam dunk champion will be Clyde Drexler. Julius Irving with a score of 41. He's earned it by Drexler, is number one in this year's slam dunk contest. That's it for this year's dunk contest, folks. It's been a slice.